Hello everyone, my name is Rami Sami and today I'm going to show you some exercises that you can do on a playground if you have some pull-up bars and today I'm at South Beach so um, here uh, we have a pull-up bar if you want to target your, uh, your back, your biceps um, and you don't have a membership at a gym you can come to a playground so let me show you some pull-ups I'm a renegade I'm a rebel Don't worry about me, about me, about me, about me, about me, about me. I'm a renegade Also, you can do some chin-ups That will target more of your bicep I'm a rebel Don't worry about me, about me can do uh, um, use your hands go on the ladder that will work out your biceps back along with your core so you have to stay in the air though I'm a renegade I'm a rebel don't worry about me about me about me about me you want it to hit your shoulders. You can come out here and do some push ups for the shoulders. Let's say you want to target your core. Um, there's this bench right here. Do some leg raises. Target your obliques. If you have, there's like a piece of wood or, or just some kind of weight on the, by the playground or something close. It's like you're hitting baseball. Every time you rotate, you try to stop it with your core. The core that if you have like a bar or something you can hang on to and do some leg raise. If you want to target your biceps, just work on that squeeze in that form to really get the blood pumping into your biceps. You can uh, do a lot of repetition. So if you're on a vacation or something, and you don't have an access to the gym, you can come to a playground. You stay fit. You can do it with one hand. That will also target your forearm because it's a wide grip. So that'll work your forearms for you too. If you want to work out your chest. You can do some push-ups and there are a lot of kind of push-ups. You can do an elevated push-up, it's a little easier, but you can work on that squeeze. Or you can do a close grip push-ups.
I'm a renegade. With the same piece of wood, you can do a compound exercises. What I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna squat, and then go up, and shoulder press it in the air. All in one movement, just like this. But um, when you go for more repetitions, that's when your heartbeat starts to go up and this exercise starts to become harder and harder. For your triceps, you can do dips and um, it will also work out your chest, depending on the way you do it. So now for triceps, just keep straight. chest, you have to lean forward a little. Don't work the chest more when you go down. Um, all these exercises that I showed you right now, you can actually combine them and do them in a circuit. So in that way, it will be a little high intensity your heart rate will boost up and uh, that will help you burn fat and also build muscle. So I'm going to show you a circuit, but you can, as I said, change them with whatever exercises you want. We'll do some pull-ups. What's that? Some pull-ups. these exercises you can put them in a circuit as I did and do about five or six of them that will really get your heart rate high and also it will boost up your testosterone because you're working out a lot of muscle groups at the same time and keeping your heart rate up so it's a high intensity cardio and muscular workout there you go showed you some exercises that you can do in a playground or if there are like a couple bars somewhere uh, let's say if you don't have a gym membership or you're on a vacation you can do these exercises so you can stay fit and um, as I showed you I showed you some exercises I'm pretty sure there are a lot more exercises you can get creative with the exercises you uh, you want to do uh, but it's a uh, you don't have to spend so much time on it. 15 minutes would be enough if you do a circuit of exercises high intensity. Thank you for watching my video. Please like, comment, share, and let me know what you guys think. If you want more videos about workouts, foods, uh, please like my fitness page on Facebook and the link provided below. Thank you.